guys, in this um, video we're going to cover the endocrine system. So it's going to be a little bit different than most of our videos. I'm going to show you the, what the structure is and then flash up on the screen um, the hormones that it secretes or produces or just secretes. Okay, So we're going to start off with the hypothalamus. So the hypothalamus is sitting up in our brain, which you may remember from 223. Okay? So the hypothalamus is this flat portion of the seahorse's face flat portion of the seahorse's face. So, you see the seahorse, flat portion of the face. That bulgy portion above it was the thalamus. This flat portion right here is the hypothalamus. Hypothalamus. Okay, so I'm going to flash the um, hormones up on the screen that it mainly produces. So it produces three different hormones, and I'll show you those in a second. In this um, part, we're going to cover the pituitary gland. So on this model, you can see the pituitary gland hanging off of the hypothalamus right there by its infundibulum, which you may remember from the 223 section. So you have hypothalamus, remember, and then hypothalamus leading to the infundibulum dangling the pituitary gland. And the pituitary gland is actually uh, unique. It has two different pieces. It has some neural tissue in the back, the neural hypothesis, and um, some other tissue in the front known as your adenohypophysis. So on this model, you can actually see the difference, okay? So the adenohypophysis is going to sit on the front and is in that pink portion. And then the neural tissue on the back is the neurohypophysis. This whole thing is the pituitary gland, adenohypophysis, neurohypophysis. And they um, produce and secrete their own unique um, Hormones. So I'm going to flash that up on the screen and then we'll move on to the next structure. Next structure you need to know is still. Um, within the uh, seahorse. So you see this little tiny pink dot on the back side? That is the pineal gland, and that helps secrete um, melatonin, which I'll flash up on the screen for you. Next, we have the thyroid gland, which sits on the front portion of your uh, larynx. Okay, so here is your thyroid gland. It would cover both sides. Okay, so the thyroid gland is responsible for producing and secreting three different hormones that I will flash up on the screen. Important to note that the parathyroid glands are not seen on our models, but they are four tiny little glands that actually are embedded into the back side or the posterior side of the thyroid gland. So go ahead and Google a picture of parathyroid glands. And, I'll, and the old, it's not tricky. It secrete, produces and secretes parathyroid hormone. Okay. Next we have the pancreas. Okay. This is the pancreas right here, which sits right there. This is the spleen from the lymphatic system. This is the pancreas connecting to the small intestine right there, which we'll cover in a later video. Sitting on top of the kidneys are the adrenal glands or suprarenal glands, okay? And they produce and secrete different hormones depending on the different layers of it, okay? So the outer layer of the adrenal glands is called the adrenal cortex. The inner layer is the adrenal medulla, and I will uh, show you the differences on the next screen. 